that when we left off we were over here and there's some stuff we're gonna do that uh, maybe see if we can go to the shoreline um, but I also noticed there was a little bit of alligator farm that I might have missed um, so we're gonna just finish it up real quick Let's see here uh, okay. Done. Out. nice I did notice uh, when I was back at the base, I was talking to uh, the lady with the booba and Mr. Scary Priest Guy, and they had some dialogue options um, that. Shit. Oh, fuck! Get back. Ashes to ashes. Woo! Wasn't ready for that. Getting right into it. Wow. We, we haven't had to actually fight one of those guys. It was freaking out a little bit. Damn, he drops gold armor. That's pretty good. Let's just take out all the others. Yeah, another one right there. Oh, he coming. Ratchet's death. All right, well. Oh, nice. We got another little boat house. Smaller boat. Real house. Real boat. 100% boat. Um, yeah, let's see if this guy dropped any ammo. He did. I will take it. Didn't replenish, but, you know. Got some back. That's just fine. Let this place and have some uh, loot for me. Some gold armor right there. Uh, gold armor, gold ammo. Oh, what's this? Last breath. New shotgun. All right. Beautifully crafted and decorated shotgun. Wielding it makes you remember things, but those things are not from your life. It's someone else's. Somebody else's. Somebody who died a hero. It mattered not how many of them there were, and it did matter. He was surrounded from all the sides. The only thing that was important is that his family was safe, and he was glad to pay the price. With each engaged enemy, damage increased by 25%. Faster reload. Does 90. Oh, wow, that's better. What does this one do? Increased acid. Give 10% chance for enemy attack to miss. Enemy hit with this weapon have their damage reduced. I don't know. The shotgun doesn't really need it. Maybe for, like, bosses that's better. Because um, bosses can take more than, like, one or two shots. But even that big dude that we killed in the last... Uh, the end of the last episode. I hit him twice with a headshot from the shotgun. He died, like, instantly. Also, this one's not worth as much. Definitely maybe a, a bank item. Uh, hang on to it. Don't, don't sell it as it seems to be a um, unique item. All right. Just being careful, making sure. Oh, I just saw a little blip on the mini map. Something's out I'd there. Always do with some more bullets. Maybe it's a. Uh... Oh, it's right there. It's the wraith guy. The freak. The freak. All right. Let's finish the boat. See something right there? Chicken head. Don't need that. Nothing in there. Ooh, there's a lower section. Through here, what's that? Oh, tomahawk. Shotgun ammo. All right, Whatever take some shotgun ammo. Oh, it's actually putting me over. I might, uh, you know, fuck it. I'll have it loaded. That'll put those two shots out of my inventory and into this gun. We can try this gun out. Here. Okay, cool, cool. Just a little, little boat. Dig it. I dig it. Is there any anything else out here? The gator right there. Let's see if a headshot from this far. Away. Well, we will never know because that was an insta kill. 
I think there's still the top part of the boat. I gotta just go double check. Nice, more short ammo in desperate need of that. Having to buy from merchants and stuff. Uh, that's spirit ammo. Oh, what's this? Safe. More spirit ammo. Just, just stuff to sell. All right, well, don't really need that right now. That's extra ammo now. That's also extra. Wow, got a lot of extra ammo. I'm already like uh, out of inventory space. It's fantastic. Just, just great. It's just fantastic. No, why, why am I doing that? I'll put that right there. Okay. Well, at least I got a uh, return home thing. Good. Let's see what this says. What is it talking about? Uh, da -da -da. Amalgamations. It won't come as a surprise. My best advice for future hunt death hunters: do not get into the water with this thing. If one must be caught, it's best to lure it into the land where it loses a lot of its speed and agility. I don't know if that was talking about the gator leech things or a uh, undiscovered monster. I see some <gasps> ammo over there though. So it just said, "Don't go in the water with them." Oh, yeah, I see that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Really fast. Holy shit. Good God. I don't think we've even seen them, like, move yet. So that was... That was pretty intense. He came flying at me. He was still pretty fast on the land, too. All right. All right. That's, uh... That was terrifying. Yeah, so that's... That's... Pretty much all I missed. So just a little boat. Oh, another gator right there. He can he can live. He he doesn't need to be taken out. Missed a gator skin on this guy at some point. Oh okay. This dude's tail's still moving. Look at it go. It's beautiful. It's just like a little 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 feather or like a, like a balloon or little entrails. Let's get back to where we left off last time, which was over here. There was a big boy camp. That's right. That's right. Did I reload the handgun? I did. Okay. Well, let's see here what we got. What the hell? Good range effective shot. Okay, so it wasn't as good. Let's see how this goes. Oh, shit. Ooh, that hit me. Whoa! Throw it. Shots like crazy. Where'd the other one go? Oh, he's on the side. Ooh, that definitely hit me. Okay, well, those things are everywhere. Yeah. I really don't like the shotgun as much as the uh, the rifle because like even if you hit your shots, headshots, it seems to not really matter. I'm not saying that I hit a bunch of headshots there. What the fuck is this? What's that? That'll come in handy. Large bag, solid backpack made for hard and little bit spacious. Open container. Whoa, it's Tarkov. I can put stuff in it now. So I can carry this, which will give me more backpack space. That's fucking sweet. There's also apparently you some money on the ground somewhere. Uh, that's, that's like the fourth time that I have found... Uh... Okay, cool, and you can right-click it. That's like the fourth time I found a bag of money on the ground just by, you know, having it there that uh, on the ground, and I, I wouldn't have ever found it otherwise. Okay, so we're going to use this bag as our, like, sell bag. So I'm going to put all my shit that I want to sell in there. And then maybe I'll pop extra ammo on this side as well. Really cool. Uh, I didn't even know this was a thing. I don't know if there was, like, a bag that I missed in the first um, playthrough or not. But, yeah, I, I, I didn't know that that was a, a thing in the game. That's really neat. Okay, well, let's see. Let's take a look at our map. Yeah, we're not even on the map anymore. Is that a? Is there a reason for that? Why am I not on the map? 
the hell? Is it because I'm... Oh, okay, I went, I went off. All right, so maybe there is still like uh, some land because I was looking no north. We want to look east. So there's a cave over here. Here's our buddy from last time. And there's some stuff down over there too. So let's... Uh, oh, yep, there's a guy right there. Just sneak up on him. Pretty professional. Pretty, pretty, pretty professional. He's facing the other way. Stay down. Stay down. It's another Skinner cave the from the looks done. of it. And we will go back and check that right side. First, I want to take these guys out, though. Headshot through the wall. See the little bullet hole. This goes deep. It's a deep cave, man. Second uh, gold that I've gotten. Can I just like hover that? I cannot. I have to do it like that. Okay. He sees me. <laughs> Shit. Insta kill. Got lucky. Gold. up here secret oh what the hell we're just entering into a whole new area now this is uh pretty cool okay take that check this chest Ooh, another new shotgun what is this oh that's a hand cannon uh Better prices at shops, faster reload to take off, die, or use purple revival. Man, I don't, I'm, I'm not a huge fan of that mechanic. I know the like, that was actually a really good chest. There was a lot of good stuff in there. Um, yeah, I understand like, you know, way and risk and reward and all that. Um, but it just at the same time, like that's a weapon. I feel like that probably shouldn't have that effect on it because that, that seems like a big pain in the ass. And what happens when you die? Does it just like fall off of you or do you do you just get to um, unequip a holy fucking shit? That's not good. He's upset with me. He's very upset with me. <laughs> All right, he's lost. He's lost track of me already. I just love me some cheese. It's my favorite part of video games. Just a little bit of cheese. Nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with cheese. Cheese is healthy for you. It's not, but it is because I want it to be. Well, uh, this was, oh, okay. So there was two of these guys up here and we just never even like went all the way up. <laughs> I don't know if you can go past that. Hold on. That kind of looked like where, yeah, that extra like uh, coastline that I wanted to check out. Well, that might be a pipe dream. All right, let's go back down in the hole. Crouch mode. We're gonna keep using shotgun just because we have the extra ammo. Oh, it doesn't look like there was really too much more here. Oh, this might be the, uh, this is the right path, I think. Nothing in the crevasses here. Stomp around super loud through these pathways. Just alert everyone that we're here. Okay, well, that was all that was. No need to come back down in here. Should have stuck by my, uh, oh shit, let me get my health back, or my stamina all the way back, so stop bleeding. Uh, should have stuck by my tried and true of explore everything before you go to a next level that I do in most video games as an avid explorer. Um, if I come across like stairs or a ladder, or a rope, or a whale, 
I always tend to um, wait, explore the whole area on the, le the, the level ground that I'm on, and then move to, that's three race, um, then I move to doing uh, other levels and stuff. Okay, one down. I didn't get him. Didn't get him again. Ooh, they're shooting me a lot. And they're shooting with ethereal shots, which is not good, because I feel, I think if I remember correctly, I might be uh, weak to them. One down. Oh yeah, that does a lot of damage. He's right on his right side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is the button to... Fucking stop. <laughs> gotcha. Alright. Not too bad, just got shot once. Where's this guy's body at? Oh, okay. Maybe if they, uh, they don't drop anything at all, they don't... have a body. Now, there's definitely something in the middle of this. Um, and the heads are never fun to deal with. That's also a crossbow right there. I got shots with these. I guess I'll take out as many of them as I can from far away. Done. Maybe just kill them all. I said fuck it. Shave frick it. Shave frick it. Nice. It's just a normal. Iron Thorn. Of course, it's another new gun. Drop that on the ground for a second. See if we can't. Faster reload. It's just worth a shitload. Okay, so we are going to need to move these. Gonna have to do another uh, inventory. Let's put these to good use. Recash heels. after this episode. Let's see what's in the middle here. We got cure. The cure for wellness. I have found the cure. Now to whom should I give it? Well, I guess you guys are going to be coming back to the base and we're going to be talking to people. Oh, I have to choose who I want to give the cure to? Because it probably can only be one person. Hmm. 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 Well, I mean... One of them is, like, a disgusting monster. And the other one is a lady with a mask on. I don't... I don't feel like those... really weigh out the same. Like, maybe the disgusting monster deserves it a little more than boobahs. But, but, I know. We're talking about boobahs here. Oh, shit. That was a good shot. Thank you. John Wiccan in here. Is there more? Yep, of course there is. Why wouldn't there be more? See, this this gun is just so much better than the shotgun. The shotgun's good for close range, and then at the same time it's not because you only have two shots. Um, oh fuck! Someone's someone's listening. But where? Oh, is it down there? Okay, well. There's a pit of death. Alrighty then, I guess we'll go take some pot shots at these guys. Well, uh, something else that I did off screen that you guys didn't get to see was um, I talked to the skull at the beginning of the game, the like quest giver gun shit, and he said if I kill six enemies with fire, I will get my curse removed from me. So that's what we're gonna do. Amazing. Beautiful. Oh, they're freaking out. I don't know, I don't know if they, whoa, oh God. I killed some of them. Deed is done. 
Nice, and if I talk to the Totem of Souls... Those are just one guy. One dude lived. Oh, there's a tre treasure chest down there. Yep, just one guy left. <laughs> Very cool. That was probably a ton of uh, experience. I also see the way to get down here. It's also going to be a good amount of these two fees. Fifteen! Oh, yeah, that's right. These guys are the 15 droppers. I don't want your bandage. I guess I do have space for it now with the extra thing and I'm going back soon to the base anyway. Oh, okay. Let's go ahead and put some extra stuff over here so I can pick up the rest of that ammo. What's um, in the chest? More stuff, more stuff, more stuff. Ooh, okay. Teleports you to save points the threat of death. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, I remember seeing that. I think someone was selling that or something. Well, first let me go ahead and put um, extra ammo into here. Close that. Put that in that space. You, you, uh, where'd that go? I will need that. <laughs> Another money sack that I didn't see on the on the ground and probably wouldn't have. So good thing that there's a full loot. Yeah, there we go. Why, why didn't I pick this up? Man, I got a lot of shit in my bag. I'll still do the uh, inventory management stuff off camera so that uh, the chunts don't need to watch. The chunt family don't need to watch that stuff. You guys just get to see me explore and kill stuff and look at boobahs. More ammo. Might go a little longer on this episode too, because um, why not? We're gonna just finish off this whole area so that we can do sawmill in the next episode. Oh fuck! I hate these things. We're gonna we're gonna put on. Oh shit! Oh thank God! I was really really hoping for it. Uh, that's sick that we got an instant kill on that. Because those guys suck. Those guys really suck. I just saw the thing pop up. Hello? 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 Let's put these to good use. Good use. Oh, shit. Man, this place is a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Oh my god, there's so many of them. Where are they going to be coming from? Are they coming around the mountain? Oh yeah, here they come. Fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get out of here. Just run. We're just getting out of here. Fuck that. Where are they going to... Yeah, they're coming from over there. Got to one. rest. Got two... Got three! Look at that. Clip it and ship it. Alright, well, we got ambushed and came out pretty much unscathed. I don't even know if I got hit. It was kind of like heat of the moment, so I wasn't paying attention too much, but if I did get hit, it might have been one time. Okay. Nice, yeah. Oh, shit, there's another guy. Wow, this fucking area turned out to be way bigger than I thought it was going to be. That's money. Not a lot of money, but it's money. Money. i check that stuff. Okay. Oh, come on. Pick it up. Pick it up. Did it put it on the ground? No, okay. Good. Good. Ammo. Never gonna have too much of those. That looks like a secret door right there. Um, let's see. Where are we on the map? Oh, we're right in front of the bridge. Okay. Yeah, so I think we can 
call that completed. That whole peninsula or area over there should be good now. Uh, this is one of the many bridges that we fuck have uh, started episodes on. And then if you look over there, there's the fort from the beginning of the series. And I also found out off camera that there is an entrance to the cave right over here, I think. Hold on. Yeah, it's right here. Yep, you gotta just squeeze right in here. Fucking shit, I'm just gonna kill myself from bleeding. So this is a big decision here. We gotta, we're gonna talk to both of them first. And we're gonna see what they say. All my prayers. And I still don't know where to find the cure. What is the seed? Did you find it? <laughs> uh, yes or no? <laughs> Simple terms. Give her the medicine? The one and only? Are you mad? Or worse? You are in league with that witch, rat, blasphemer. Don't even try to insult me like this. Only the worst of the scum would not give that cure to me. <sighs> wow. Very persuasive with your words, dude. Holy shit. Can you fucking get off the ladder? Good God. Be careful around here. Yeah? Don't tell me you've actually found it. You can do whatever with it if you ever find it. Finders keepers, right? And it's not like I'm the only ill person here. I don't have the right to decide. Oh, man. Who do I give it to? That's a that's a big question. Because on one hand, we got Booba. And on the other hand, we've got Pulsating Priest. Um, the priest seems kind of like an asshole. Um... I really don't know. Why are they putting a dilemma on me like this? I Don't make me decide. Why would you make me decide what I have to do in this video game? But make decisions for me. God, I have so many of these things. You could swear that this small ball emits a blue light that silently your instincts tell you that this may be important to someone. Well, she doesn't even really seem to like want it God give me strength to carry on <laughs> he seems like he's like halfway in the, in the death door though like I don't I don't know if we should should give it to him did you find it yeah <laughs> uh, yes or no all right all right Simple terms. i know what we're gonna do i know what we're gonna do we're gonna do a little bit of skate saves coming yeah, yeah yeah fuck off um so well, we what i'm gonna do is i'm going to save and exit save and exit there we go so now we've got we've got our save right there we're gonna start again Making this a special episode, that's why it's a little longer, because we've explored a whole bunch. Got a good amount done. Alligator farm, 100% complete. Got two new special weapons. Three new special weapons, I think. Yeah, two shotguns and then that crossbow. And then uh, we're going to finish it off with uh, talking to these people. So, game always has a little bit of trouble loading here like loads halfway and then doesn't work so the way this is going to work oh shit let me go talk to the totem real quick you're back and you did what yay so now i'm no longer cursing um so we're gonna start we're gonna give the cure to him first imagine all the good i could did you find it <laughs> I knew God has bigger plan for me, and I can't just die here. With this, I can live for long, long time. I've decided who will live and who will most likely die. Such a horrid place. Talking restless dead. Monsters cursed. 
by an R. Ooh. Okay, so that's all it does is it just decides who's going to live in the... No, I want Booba to live. You know, I, I actually think I want Booba to live. Um, so the way this works, since I'm probably going to have to close out the game, um, I'll just call it wraps here. We're going to load back in. We're going to give the cure to Booba. Booba's better. Booba's better than face guy. This thing, this is disgusting. This guy's head is nasty. Uh, so um, I've decided. I've made the uh, deci decision. That is more important. Look at him go. Look at him go. Look at him just bounce in the wind. A little slight cave breeze, and they're, they're just fucking, they're all over the place. All right, well, uh, see you guys next time in the Blood West. <laughs>